So you've got a recovery partition and you want to delete it. And you've noticed that by right clicking, you don't get the delete option. So how do you blitz it? Well, it's not that straightforward. Uh, the easiest way is to open up disk part, the disk partition tool that will be on Windows. I always suggest running it in administrator mode. It comes up and let me position it there so you can see that recovery partition. And you have to issue a few commands. You know, the first one is list disk. We'll show you the different disks that you have. And the disk that is the partition that I want to delete is disk zero. So then you do select disk zero. So disk zero gets selected. And then you list your partitions, which is list partition. And you can see I've got partition one, two, three, and partition three is the recovery. So I want to say select partition three. So partition three is now selected. And then all I have to do is say delete partition and then override. And if you don't do override, it's going to say, hey, you don't have permissions to delete this. And it's going to give you all sorts of trouble. But if you do that override command, it will delete it. And you can see now, if I go back to my computer management and look at disk management, well, that recovery disk is gone. And now I can extend this volume or expand it or do whatever I want to do without worrying about that recovery partition. So there you go. That's how easy it is to delete the recovery partition.